Hey guys, it's me Janamer and today I'm gonna show you how to shave your face if you're a woman, not man, okay? Okay guys, today I want to show you how I shave my face, but before I do that, I want to talk about why I actually do this. Uh, this is not new, dermaplaning, this is another word for the face shaving. Dermaplaning came a while, while ago, even in the 50s and 60s, Marilyn Monroe used to do this, Elizabeth Taylor used to do, and this trend is it's been for a while it's just coming very 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 popular right now especially in the united states people are doing in the everywhere in the world in the usually in the salons these are combined together with the microdermabrasion or chemical peel exfoliation and this is good really really good why because it's exfoliate your skin so basically you remove your hair together with the with this facial glaze and with this with this kind of removing hair thing you you are removing your dead skin also this usually is done in salon which is way more professional but you can do this also at home if you buy this like this is eyebrow razors and you can do it at home there is a myth that uh, hair can grow thicker black more black or more like here this is absolutely not true and I want to read for you guys what one of the best uh, German hairstylist says about this so I'm just gonna read exactly his words what he is saying and his name is Dave and the Dave, Dave is saying about the sh facial shaving why it doesn't grow hair like more black or thicker or what what are most of us women are afraid that the hair gonna grow thicker right so I'm gonna read his word what is he saying he says as a hairdresser I have heard all these myths all the time like the hair grows back black and thicker if you shave too often or the hair of babies had to be shaved two or three times to make sure that the hair grow gets better and they they get a lot more and better hair after ATC. That is already definitely not true. The root of your hair sits so deep in your scalp that it doesn't notice anything at all if you shave anything. It doesn't get affected, touch or anything. Same with all these products for thicker hair or less hair loss. This product can't reach the roots of your hair and if so you definitely can just buy them at the drugstore because these products will affect your blood steam in order to reach the part of your hair where they actually could do anything. So you can shave your face, legs, etc. as much as it has often. You want it could never ever affect your big growth, thickness or the color of your hair. I promise. So guys, this kind of myth is, is fail, it's not true. You shave your face, you exfoliate your face, you're gonna have a nicer, fresher skin, like more newer cells. If you apply any serum, any any cream is gonna like moisturize it better your skin and it's gonna work this this serum or cream better for your skin than if you apply on the skin with the hair i don't recommend you to do i'm just showing what i'm doing i loving this this is professional they do in the salons all estheticians all their dermatologists okay so i take new facial razor today i'm very close to you so you can see how i'm gonna do and before that what i do is recommended to the to do on the like dry skin so i'm gonna show you guys how i do first i disinfect my skin i know this is not the best because your skin looks like really really dry but i want to disinfect first my skin and then show you guys how I do it I want to disinfect because it's better to disinfect to not get breakouts or acne you know some visitors this is very popular with the microdermabrasion microdermabrasion chemical peels like rolling derma roller most of the parts where are my hair are here around my mouth I hate this like mustache you know for the woman and here on the side usually guys if you go to the like esthetician or dermatologist in the salon they are doing like upper like this but I'm not gonna do up because they do when you lay down they do from your head side from the back so that's why it's better like this but I'm gonna do everything just to the side so I take my skin like this make sure you don't go like straight but you go like side you know what I mean Oh guys, I wish you can see if <laughs> I 
if you're doing this first time guys so do really 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 carefully really careful because you can cut yourself okay all right so this part of my face i already shave it's nice and smooth if when you guys gonna shave the first time I promise you you're gonna touch like this is so nice and smooth and here is like okay it's your skin you know it's normal and here it's so nice and smooth so when you when you shave your face you're gonna see with on the razor there is a bunch of like baby hair and also like that skin this is so cool like i can tell i know guys you're not gonna see but uh, this is what i just wanted to show you how i shave my face and now i'm gonna finish the the other side And this is for all type of African Americans, like darker skin, Asians. The hair doesn't grow thicker or more or bigger or... It's just a natural. Okay, my mustache. I also do between my brows, so I just want to show you how I do. On the top of the brows, just a little bit, not too much. So much hair. A little bit forehead. If you have like a short forehead, many women have over here like kind of triangles, so you can shape this too. And then you can go down the eyebrow right here. Okay, the other side. I know some of you guys you think she is crazy but believe me this is very popular in United States and especially in California all the stars are doing this and at the same time you also massage your skin which is regenerating and really good You can do on your nose if you have to, but I don't have anything here. Kind of works like a scrub, I really like that feeling. Alright, so now I'm going to wash my skin because you have to wash your skin after each of using. Oh my god, so much dirt in this thing, you guys cannot see. Wow, so much dead skin and everything, I don't know how to do that you could see, but I don't think so. But believe me, my face seems so like so smooth, so fresh. Like it seems like I got just like crazy, crazy like lifting facial, and I really, really love it. And now I'm gonna apply cream. This is a Dr. Brand Lineless Infinite Moisture, like this. My face literally, literally feels like a baby skin i don't know it looks like it feels so like kind of naked my skin oh my god it is kind of a little bit some places more red because um kind of works like exfoliator but i'm so happy because i feel so wonderful really 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 and these and these razors cost like i don't know i bought these from ross i paid three dollars really really nice i still have one left you have to do like i think this kind of stuff you have to do like once a month hair don't grow thicker don't grow more guys try it you're gonna love it i promise you there is there is such amazing thing for your face i love it i love it i love it all right guys that's it for today's thank you thank you thank you so much for watching if you like this video give me a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe let me know if you have tried this or not and if you would like to maybe i'm gonna book appointment in the like in the salon so i can film in if they're gonna let me and i can show you guys how this work in the salon like professional procedure i don't know let me know if you like to see this and that's it for now i love you guys i'll see you in my next video bye open <laughs> open let go! Oh, yeah. Let go! You're biting it! Just your lips!